How's it going, DigiDs? Thank you for checking out the channel and for clicking on this video. Today, we're back at you with another episode of Halo Infinite. I believe this is like episode 8 or 9 at this point. I've forgotten. Now, it has already happened. I was going to say finally happened, but honestly, I haven't been in this for too long to say finally. It has already happened. Some of you might already realize that I'm in a weird spot again. So, in the last episode that you have all actually seen was that I went from around... I went around this area, cleared out some some goons, cleared the whole area. I think I kind of moved around. Maybe it was this section, I believe. But what you did miss is that I did, I cleared out these squads and this tower and or that fort. I cleared out a couple eliminations. I cleared out this squad. I think it's where I last left off. But what happened is when I looked over to my OBS to see what was going on, it had completely frozen. It lost about half the footage and it just wasn't playable at all. So... Big sad, already happened, having corrupted footage, but hey, you know, it is what it is. But today, we already have a bit of a plan. You know, it might be a little bit of a shorter plan, but we'll see how long it takes us. First, we're going to get rid of this fob here that's directly in front of us, which you might be able to see off of the distance. That little orange light and that big blue light? Yeah, sitting there on top of that hill. And of course, you know, I, I don't remember which episode I mentioned it in, but I'm going to mention it in this one, is that I'm going to try to make a point to start every episode, if possible, with a whole bunch of marines and right now they've got a whole bunch of volatile skewers <laughs> so we'll see how effective that's going to be so we're going to take out this fob we'll go check out and take out this army i guess it is it looks like it's another fort we'll take out that fort and then if it hasn't taken too long we can go ahead and uh take a look at what the excavation site has to offer maybe we can get a start to get the dialogue going and see where we are but um yeah that's our plan for today so without further ado let's just drive on in and see what these marines can do. I just got them all hooked up and drove over here, so I'm not really sure what they're capable of. We could use an LZ out here. Fire! Let's secure oh, fire. yes! <laughs> oh, no, I got stunned. These are the volatile skewers. Oh, they've got one of their own. These are the volatile skewers, so they explode on impact. Jesus, come on! But I'm a little bit confused. I thought the skewers fired in like a in a straight line and just kind of like you know skewered them against the wall. Excuse me. These ones seem to have like a bit of an arc to them. Fire. Yeah, stack them up. These ones seem to have a big arc to them. Bob Bravo is ready for liberation. Ready for liberation. Okay, cool. I wonder if I can get a new razor back without losing my marines. I don't want them to lose other weapons. It takes a minute to get the, all those weapons into their hands. <laughs> And sometimes they don't like the weapons, and they just you drop it. suffered through a lot on this ring. But thanks to you, they have a chance at survival. Wow. And this is why I never remember... This is why my episodes always get thrown off, because I never... I always forget that every time I figure out one of these fobs, it reveals stuff in the area. So it just revealed a fort that's over there. So I think what we're going to do instead, Digis... Yes, I just called you Digis. I don't know, you're my Digi-Ds. <laughs> is that let's go take a look at what that Spartan core is free up these uh free up this squad and then go take out this uh fort over there new phones online nice work chief orders yeah give me another razor back please Stand by for vehicle drop. while that's happening listen to this uh listen to this audio log while I try to corral all these marines back in come on boys honk 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 Hell yeah, we'll make it. And they did not make it out in one piece. In fact, actually, he lied to all of them. He got thrown out of an airlock, left them all to die, and nearly the entire ship was nice. killed in space. Are we sure this isn't a wasp? But who's counting? Detected. More Marines in trouble. Let's Marines. go be heroes. Trouble? Where? Oh, off to my right. That's a clean kill. Well, you know what? That's if they're close, if they're easier to drive to, it might be just right up over here. Vanish, huh? Same crap, different rapper. It, what? Same crap, different rapper? One of them port freaks found a sniper rifle. I don't think I've ever I'll heard that it. saying before, but all right. Ah, yeah, here they are. All right, well, let me just prop up. <laughs> Chief, enemy reinforcements. And now they can go to work. Oh, you know what, Marines? Take it out. Take it out. Artillery strike that phantom. <laughs> <laughs> we all got our limbs. Thanks for that. <laughs> they can't drop off more units, but they got nothing Office to drop it off with. I think we're clear. 
They fought well, don't you think? Yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> I mean, well, yeah, these Marines, they fought well. That's for damn well sure. Holy crap. Alright, one of you jump in. You're not gonna have a special weapon, but any one of you. Come on, get in. I got space for one more. Hopping in. Yeah, little AR buddy. You got my close quarters when I eventually jump out, right? You're not gonna accidentally kill me like the other ones probably will? <laughs> I wish I could tell them to, like, follow along in other vehicles. That'd be kind of nice. Okay, so let's not get myself killed here. I'm driving into what is this? This like is incredible. Camp? All right. So there's a Spartan core around here somewhere. That's what we're looking for. Keep Open fire. <laughs> the AR just like peppering them. Just I guess he's stun locking them a little bit while the volatile skier is open fire. <laughs> he's helping. He's part of the team. Bouncing around while I drive up here. Enemy fire. Come on, shoot! Thank you. Am I moving around too much? Is that the problem? A couple of those look like they didn't explode right away. Fire on those hostiles now! I'm firing. You can say that. I'm firing. Any distance, just artillery strike them. Yeah. <laughs> I heard him die. There's still a couple more hiding over there. Yep, there you go. Now, where is this Spartan core? Okay, so it's definitely downstairs. How do I get down there? Excuse me. Come on, work with me. Don't tip over. <laughs> Jeez. So it's probably from down below, though, right? Where I was originally? That would make the most sense, right? Into the side face of this cliff here nothing been hiding out in caves for months you have any idea how much weird crap I've had to eat Ugh. okay thank you for the short story of the marine I nobody asks ah here we go um we can fit we can fit <laughs> oh no 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 Ooh. Come on. Yeah. We can fit. We will fit. <laughs> Come on. Arc the shot over. You got this. Take all those jackals. Oh, I did not want to do it. But they got too much cover. I'll drive real slow for you. Yeah. <laughs> Take out that elite before. Yep. At least the Bruce, they throw the spike grenades. Those do do a lot of damage, but they won't, like, tip you over and blow you out of the sky or whatever. I'm afraid of, like, the elites. You know, they've got those plasma grenades as much as the grunts do. Excuse me. Shoot him off, shoot him off, shoot him off. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, so it turns out it's bad to try and ram Bruce. And it's also bad to bring a bunch of Marines with explosive weapons with you. Gosh damn it. <laughs> You nearly killed us, Marines. <laughs> they tipped us over and then hit us again. Holy yay. All right, all right, get him. Get him before you kill us. Just like that, you have to take out the strong guy. I hear it. There it is. There you are. <laughs> ah, perfect. All right, so now we are headed over to the fort. Oops. So I will see you guys over there. I'm aboard. Let's go. Let's go. And here we are rolling up to the base. Still got our damaged razor back and our... I noticed, I think we lost one Marine. We had four of these, uh... Four We're of these before, the but now we only got three. And we got the AR. Abolition. It's blasting out tons of signals. Including decrypted UNSC trans. Well, don't stop early for whatever reason, but man, get a load of this. We triggered a lockdown. <laughs> They're not letting this facility go without a fight. Wow. All the more reason to take that array apart. Let's get the lockdown lifted. All right, all right, weapon. I get it. Yeah, we got to take it down. But like, what? My God, absolute actual artillery strike. No. Ooh, that was close. 
Oh, they locked the doors, huh? Well, that sounds very aggressive. Right? Well, if you want violence, then I'll show you violence, Mr. Grunt Man. Over the intercom, forward. Okay. So, I just need to uh, open the door. Marines, you stay right there. I wish they would stay in the door a little bit longer. Open this gate. Please don't kill me. Everyone get back in the razor back. Back in the razor back. Don't die to the grenade. You guys seem to fire more and more accurately when you're in a vehicle for some dumb reason. No! Oh, there goes that. <laughs> Don't die! The get away from it! Ooh. Alright, Marines. Do what you came here to do. And that is use aimbot. Excuse me, I swear to god, that skier just went right through that elite. Don't worry, I know. The real life just lagged for you, Marine. <laughs> All right, so what is my objective? <clears throat> Destroy the communications array. All right, let me go take care of this little bugger though. I don't want him taking out my Marines. Thank you. It looks like I damaged it enough to blow it up. They really like hiding. They pop up on the radar for half a second. Yeah. <laughs> I guess they're still helpful even outside the vehicle. All right, so I need to. It's telling me I need to go open that. But in order to open that, I have to get inside somehow. Is it through the top? It's probably through the top. Hey, look at that! It's through the top. Never saw it coming. <laughs> Take this. And, uh, you forgot this. There's one more. Oh, I should've aimed it. <laughs> no, thank you. Yeah, the Commando is certainly much stronger in campaign than it is in multiplayer. The multiplayer is terrible. Alright, I hear a little beepy. There you are. Play the audio while I try to figure out how to open this door. Good thing the audio could sound like it was nearly finished there, but Marines, I, facility. I die to see myself surrounded by like three different Marines, all with skewers, and not shooting <laughs> the, the leap that came up right behind me. Oi. <laughs> what good are you for? Come on now. <laughs> okay, fine. They came from around, huh? Why are you already hurt? What did you take damage from? There. Oh, that's the wrong grenade. But that does work. Now that one, he took a lot of bullets. He took that electro, that EMP grenade. Nope, he stuck one of them. Yeah, he took one of those and like a full clip of this DMR. There we go. Okay, it was just the one with an AR. <laughs> he doesn't matter. As long as I still got the skewer buddies. I'm looking for something in here. Another switch. Exposed to power cells. Ah, okay. Okay. Great. The array's panels are exposed. You know what? Let me waste this now AR real quick. To... Not good. Banish reinforcements inbound, chief. Okay, so um 
When doing objectives, make sure that you look both ways for running brutes. They tend to not stop for pedestrians in the crosswalks. <laughs> because they apparently just take you out out of nowhere. The raised panels are exposed. Okay, now fine. Let me <laughs> pay attention to what Finish I'm doing. Inbound, chief. <laughs> Thank you, Marie. <laughs> Ooh, good shot! You know, let me go take out the guy that's also shooting artillery at us. Oh, they weren't that called the Ravager? Let me just stick you. Never mind. See that? Yeah, I saw that. I was shooting him, and then you shot him. I saw that. <laughs> Oh, you are lucky that saved you the first time. Okay, so as I was doing, what do I do? I, do I gotta like shoot these somehow? Ah, that's a somehow. It's working. Three more to go. I don't want to waste my ammo for this, but oh well. Let me juggle a pulse carbine over here. Oh, more. Come on, open fire, open fire. Oh, I'm sorry, did I kill him too fast for you? <laughs> Alright, where's the last one? It's hiding around here somewhere, isn't it? Yeah, that, that little last one. So I can attach to it. Nice. Come here, come here, come here. Comms array destroyed. You made life for <laughs> the surviving you down. UNSC personnel on this ring a little safer. There are still scanning towers in operation around the ring, but they'll be less effective without the nerve center. Good work. Good work. Okay, cool. God, weapon, you talk way too much. <laughs> um, I give her too much crap. She's good. She's fine. All right, so that was actually... That wasn't too bad. That was actually kind of quick. However, I say... Let's go take out this fav a barim guy. See what he has to offer. Is there any vehicles Moving around up. here that I can pick up? You know what? Marine, if I can't take you with me. How are you holding up, Chief? I'm holding up great. Now that I got this, I have someone to go kill. Oh, not like a ghost, not like a not like, you know, like a wraith or a tank, a mongoose or nothing nearby? No? Well, <laughs> country roads take me home to the place that I belong, West Virginia. I don't know the rest of the lyrics. Honestly, that could have already been wrong. Nothing else really comes to mind, though, at this point when I'm just going across rocks. We're closing in on Thav Seberim, high-ranking Banish target. He's got a lot of blood on his hands. Time for some payback. You know, it could almost be Ireland. Or like somewhere in like Wales. Very rocky, very lot of outcroppings, you know? All right, yep, I was just trying to fill the dead silence because I didn't feel like having to edit that part out. <laughs> so, uh, about that vehicle thing, uh, you don't see me yet. Come back here. Hello? Well, he'll, he'll come back around. Yeah, yeah, come on, come on. Come over here, come over here. Mine. Thank you. I may not even need the Impaler if I got this. First of all, I'm going to take care of you. Where did you, where'd you go? Oh, hello. Someone's got a bolt shot. Or a mangler, what do they call that? Can't see in the sun. Oh, there's the main guy. Heck, I might be able to just pick him off from here. Was he also in a ghost? He is in a ghost. Heck, maybe I can just kill him by killing him the ghost. He's not going to be... Like, I wonder if his ghost is stronger. Yeah, good vehicle combat boss battle. <laughs> oh, no. Woo. Oh, another one. <laughs> I did kill his, though. I haven't taken a whole lot of hits. Hey, no, no, no running, no running. There are his goes. Nice. 
Enemies incoming. Yeah, I hear them coming. He doesn't have a whole lot of allies guarding him. Although I guess that's what this is aiming to fix. Run them all over. Run away. It's still alive. It's on fire though. <laughs> I don't know what the I don't know what the second fire is and when it's about to die. I thought it would like lose its wings or something. Oh boy. Hang on. I gotta take you out. Even if this ghost dies, I can't have him living. He's gonna snipe me in a couple of shots, no problem. We've already seen me die a couple times that way. At least once. You know, you're not so invisible when I can see your shield breaking. Oh, no, no, no. No escaping me now. Yeah. That's a wrap on the target. Let's clean up the rest of them. Clean up the rest of them? Where, who, where are the rest of them? Severine's death won't bring back all the civilians he killed, but he'll never take another human life again. He got what he deserved. Good work, Chief. Yeah, I saved people by murder. But I got something called, what was it, the Arcane Sentinel Beam? Ooh, boy, that goes through his ammo fast, but that does look cool. And dang, that, yeah, that had, like, no ammo whatsoever. Oh, did he have any? He died, what, right over here, right? Oh, yeah, he did. Perfect. Let's go see if we can test it out a little bit. Um, ooh, why don't we go test it out? Well, for the last thing that we'll do this episode, I think we'll go take out that guy. So that way for next mission, or next time we have, we come back to this, we can do that. We can do that one fort. Get this propaganda tower. Is that... No, I always think the armories are Spartan cores. And then we can start in on the excavation site. But for now, let's go take a look at what the Sentinel Beam will do to a target. I'm excited. It's an arcane Sentinel Beam. That looks like it's just going to absolutely melt shields. Like, no tomorrow. I wonder what it's going to do to health, though, right? Geronimo! Is this going to kill me? Nope. <laughs> a very subpar, like, lame landing. Uh oh, come on, don't get me stuck now. No, no, I can sense the editing coming on. No, travel, please go smooth. I don't want to have to edit. If this ends up terrible, I'll have to edit it out. Go, Vanished further and beyond. Ahead. Looks like a mining operation. That must be the dig site the Spartan was talking about. Oh, I accidentally dropped into the main objective. Like, I don't remember coming by <laughs> or seeing a fort nearby. I'm trying to just get to my main objective, please. Or not my main objective, my my secondary what objective of murder. They are doing exactly no, no, don't start the main dialogue yet. La 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 la. Start the dialogue where, where the enemy's more. nearby. How could they? We're in range of Bitbap yeah. the Vanquisher, one of the UNSC's most wanted, if you can believe it. Let's see how he fares against a Spartan. Let's see how he fares against the Sentinel Beam. Oh God! Oh God! Oh Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Ah! <laughs> See how he fares against, and I'm dead. <laughs> um, so stay in the ghost, kill some of his uh, his lackeys. Spartans. My God, <laughs> that was that was horrible. That was wretched. That was immediate. Just surrounded by every single EMP device known to man. Yeah, they got jackals, grunts of the wahoo, but <laughs> they got. A sniper that probably hit me at the same time. Take him out. My god. <laughs> I just wanted to test out the Sentinel Beam. It looked like it did melt his shield pretty dang fast. But I also just got melted faster. <laughs> to be fair, I'm one gun and they have like 30 guns. So it's not exactly a fair trade-off at the moment. Chief! Uh, more drop. I'm trying to save him for the end so I can test out the weapon. I want to like a good health bar to see how it actually does for damage. So I can, you know, have something to compare it to. Where's that sniper? Where's that sniper? Ooh, ooh he's stunning me with the grenade. Luckily, I don't do a lot of damage, but that will. Let me blow that up. Yeah, there we go. He stunned me again. I think the ghost is almost dead at this point. Definitely about to be dead. Alright. That's it. 
What just blew up? Excuse me. Like, where are the fireworks coming from? It's a burn damage. All right, he's still alive. Kill his friends, kill his allies. God, they, they're throwing all the EMP grenades. All right, good, good. It's just him now. Let's see how this thing does. With them out of the way. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, it was the other way around. It did do good damage to the shields, but... I think you just killed the universe's deadliest grunt. And that's I... one less hassle for the UNSC on this ring. Are you sure about that? That grunt, that second his shields dropped, my god, that sentinel beam melted him. That was straight, like... That was like plasma to the face melted out the skull in half a second. My god, that was brutal. <laughs> uh, what is this? The calcine disruptor? Oh, it's a little better disruptor thing that has, I guess, exploding AoE. Ah, let me get my BR and this sentinel beam. My god. <laughs> the boss killer. I, I, I almost I should try to keep this with me throughout the excavation site. It's not, I know there's probably going to be a boss battle in there, right? So wait until I get to a boss battle and use it then because that just did... Wow, that <laughs> did a lot of damage. <laughs> but alright, thank you for DGDs for checking out the video. Feel free to hit that subscribe button. You know, we're only at 29 subscribers now. Help me hit that big 3-0. Get this channel doing numbers at 30 subscribers. You know, feel free to hit the like button and comment down below if on what you like to see out of this series and what other type of series that you'd like to see on the channel. So thank you, DGDs, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.